So this is one of those games I cannot pass up. Uh, this is one of the bigger series I did on my channel that kind of got my fan base going. And for those of you that were with me during my original uh, playthrough of Alan Wake, welcome back. <laughs> for those of you that are not, uh, this is going to be... This actually takes place two years after Alan Wake. It's not Alan Wake 2, it's just Alan Wake. It's a standalone DLC, it's like 15 bucks. Uh, you get on Xbox Live Marketplace. But anyways, let's get to it. I didn't want to make this introduction too long. I'm kind of eager to see what happens. And uh, yeah, let's experience this together. Show some love if you can with a like favorite. I hope this does well. Because my other one did well. And yeah, let's do this. and light that is both ancient and eternal. He is chasing a dangerous quarry, the Herald of Darkness. <laughs> His evil doppelganger, known only as Mr. Scratch. Maybe, but what are you gonna do then? By then, I'll have had my hands on everything you love. has been brutally spat out from the darkness that surrounds the shores of our reality. He has come to fight a decisive battle in Night Springs. Well, I can say the graphics definitely look different. Oh god, look at these controls. Just like the original. <laughs> no different. I think all the games here recently have been running from the light. Oh my god, you have got to be shitting me. We're starting this so soon. This is not good. This is not good. Oh. I had flashbacks to that train incident on Alan Wake. <laughs> oh god. So this takes place two years after Alan Wake. It's a non-related event, apparently. It's just basically about his battle with Mr. Scratch. I can't really explain the story if you haven't really, you know, haven't really uh, kept up with the originals, so this one might not make sense, but yeah. Oh, look at those guys, they're back. There we go. It's going to be like that again, huh? Holy shit! I already know what's next! These are those big guys. <laughs> oh, take that! Yeah, I stayed up late for this one. In another I was life, like, I am gonna be first on this one. Writer. He still practices that art, forging weapons of war out of ideas. But the violent currents that brought him here have scattered the pages. He has written. Okay, back to these manuscripts. There's gonna be a lot of comments this series I can already feel. Brad, you missed a manuscript here. You missed one there. 
Let's look at them. Oh, and actually already has all of them written out there. Let's see how many we got. Okay, there's a lot. Whoa, there's the, uh... Maybe there's some more theme music from that same band. My name is Alan Wake, and I'm a writer. I didn't become one overnight. Like most writers, I struggled with it. A short story here, an article there. Then I got lucky and spent a year as a staff writer on the Night Springs TV show. It wasn't the great American novel of my fantasies, but it taught me discipline and craft, and the difference between wanting to be a writer and actually writing. Awesome. <laughs> I'm going to make this part as long as I can before I pass out. I was really wanting to stay up and get this up before I went to bed. And hopefully this works out. The lights of the motel promise safety. The man senses that the solution to his predicament begins there. Ooh. I'm digging the feel of this game, though. It has that, uh, the whole American wasteland... Not American Wasteland, what the fuck am I talking about? American Nightmare, excuse me. Somewhere within the Earth, space itself has been pierced, and from dark depths runs a steady flow of monsters. The man recognizes the hand of his evil double in this. He knows he must put an end to this madness. Holy shit. I've got to fight all those guys, too. He's just, like, looking back like, oh, hell no. Nah. All right, time to go. Sometimes running was the best option. Or I can just wait for him to get near here. How about that? Come on, come on, come on. Can't stay here now. Yeah, what you know about that? Uh oh. Oh, time to go. <laughs> now it says escape, but do I really need to? You know? Here's a shotgun. Pump action. Sad how many problems you can Yeah! Uh oh. Shit. I'm already out of, like, light and everything. If I stay right here, though, can they... I'm gonna see how close they get. There we go. Let me go back and get that ammo, since they, uh, are gone? Or maybe they're not gone. Oh, look at them in the background. You see them in the distance back there? Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, get that and get the hell out of here. <laughs> this is just like old times. Now, where did he put his pistol? Is he carrying it? No, he's not. Okay. He just goes in those magic places. It, the controls are exactly like the other one. Interesting. Really? I gotta get three manuscripts before I can do this. I'm trying to think what this reminds me of. Reminds me of like a movie I saw a little while back. Oh, let's see here. What we got? I hope this truck doesn't come to life. How much you want to bet it does? Now, the way the manuscripts worked originally was they were, uh... They would tell series of events that were about to happen. Let me see what we got over here. There's a flare... Oh, flare gun. Oh, I forget about you, flare gun. Are they around me anywhere? Okay, we're good. Flares are pretty much the best thing in this game. I like how they're not holding anything back. They're getting you started quick. I'm gonna look over here. I'm just kind of looking around for manuscripts. Because it says I need three to get that thing, and I, I don't know. I figured if I could already get it, that'd be sweet. This game's kind of quiet, though. I might have to crank the volume up. That or my TV's too low. <laughs> I don't know. Alright, let's investigate this garage. Guess we're going around. Oh, here we go. Hello. Ooh, who's that? Hey, it's you. 
There. You remember me, right? Emma? Emma Sloan? I think you might have something that belongs to May. Really? A typewritten page? Oh, yeah, that's weird. I, I did find a page like that. I don't even know where it came from. It was all this weird stuff about the oil derrick and a satellite. Yes, that's what I'm looking for. Oh, well, I don't know how you knew I had it, but I, I guess it's yours. Listen, what's this all about? There are these really creepy guys hanging around the oil derricks. There's something really weird about them. They're dangerous. I'm gonna deal with them. Try to stay out of their sight, okay? And stay in the light. They hate the light. Interesting. Avatar award. What kind of avatar? I mean, the I don't do that bullshit. recognizes the page he got from a woman. It is a weapon of his own design. Custom engineered to destroy the dark portal. If he recreates the conditions of the page, a great power will be unleashed. Alright, three items for the writing. At least they'll start out very easy to navigate. I'm not sure how this game's gonna play out. Uh, the other one... Ooh, what we got here? Another flare? I should be fine. Hang on, let me... Oh, hell. I'm gonna this look at all gonna these. Good. Is this on? How can you tell? I'm sorry, I'm not very good with gadgets. Ah, that's more like it. I'll be right with you. I just gotta do this one thing. I like it quiet. I bet you're wondering why this is happening. Why am I doing all this? Why am I so hell-bent on ruining your life? You're cramping my style. You've got money, fame, everything you could want. But you don't know what to do with it. I do. I'm getting all the things you never had the balls to go for. Having more fun, too. <laughs> Do you know the real difference between us? I'm not afraid to be the center of attention. This poor slob's just collateral damage, really. I mean, I made some information out of him earlier. But this part? This is just for kicks. <laughs> Alright, how about that? Just kills him? Mm, so quiet. He's trolling now. He is trolling. I wasn't going to stick to the whole thing, but I figured you guys might want to see it. Alright, let's head over to this location first and maybe, uh... Oh, uh, wait. wait! Are you shitting me? Whoa. Ooh. What's up with the cops? They're supposed to, you know... Be chill. Oh, fuck. Alright, fuck this. Yeah, what you know about flares, bitch? Huh? Yeah, pop and go. There we go. Oh, well, there's the valve. That's one thing down. That's one thing. <laughs> Let's go to the next. Now, I got a flare gun. I haven't used it yet. I'm actually saving that in case I get cornered. And it's just, uh... Actually, I actually haven't used a pistol that much either. How many do I need for this? Ten manuscripts? I must be coming back to this area a lot. That's the only explanation I can think of. American Nightmare. You know, I was looking at the uh, the thumbnail I used for this. I was trying to find one that fit. I figured why not just go with the cover art. <laughs> what we got over here looks like a, either a manuscript or... Yeah, it looks like another one. I like how it actually reads it to you now. Holy shit, I got two of them. Alright, let me, I'm gonna do this and I'll go back to that other crate and get that thing. The reality we take for granted is softer, more adaptable than we think. 
Under correct conditions, you can reshape it, turn it into almost anything you want. When it happens, almost nobody notices. It's not that we forget, it's that after the change, there's nothing to remember. Only those who have been directly touched by the powers that can shift reality are aware of the changes. Many are driven mad by it. Others can cope. I'm one of those people. And I know how to wield that power to rewrite reality. I'm gonna look at this one as well, just to be safe. At the oil derrick, the wheel had been jammed in place and turned until the oil gurgled and flowed thick and flammable. The warning lights were blinking in a fast rhythm, bright and steady, powered by the battery. The Kasabian CD was playing in the boombox, all distorted guitars and intense beat. High above, some piece of orbital junk or another collided with the satellite, knocking it radically off course. Trailing debris, it screamed down from the skies at an impossibly steep angle. All that high-tech engineering reduced to nothing more than a bullet that would destroy whatever it hit. Interesting. So to me, it's kind of like, uh... It's just like the other one. Oh wait, here's another piece. Or maybe it's in there. Yeah, definitely in there. <laughs> oh, really? Guess I gotta go through the other side. Here we go. Or not. That's cool, too. I'm hoping that the, uh... That the manuscripts, because you don't really find them all in order. I guess if you go exactly how you're supposed to. Shit! What the fuck, Charles, is that? The enemy tears itself in two to avoid the hated light. Holy shit. Because of anger. That's new. Such a shit. Of horror. Oh, fuck. How many are there? There's four now. Yeah, I just quadruple. Yeah, <laughs> take that, bitch. All right. Let's see if we can get through here this way. That was just messed up. All oh, the pump action's back. Something tells me I'm really gonna need the extra firepower. Oh, that's a carbine rifle. Excuse me. I'll try the rifle. The rifle, I think it was like a one shot. That's two. Just one, one shot more to go. kill kind of thing. But I cannot remember. It's been a while. I remember doing this uh, original Alan Wake series back last May. It's like right around the time my sister was getting married and a bunch of other stuff was going on because... I don't know, that was that was a crazy point in my life too. Trip down memory lane for you all. And let me know in the comments when you uh, first got to my channel. You know, I'm kind of curious to see... Oh wait, let me go to the health really quick. I just saw my health up there. <laughs> I'm curious when you found my channel, you know? Was it before or after that series, or is it with with this one, maybe, you know? Who knows? Yeah! Uh-oh. Probably should have stuck with the pump action. You can just kind of aim it. It doesn't really do as much now. On the other one, you could just like not really aim it towards them. You just kind of point, and it would do a little bit, and you could just do it like that. But all right, where the hell is this thing at? Here we go. That's everything. The man has found the battery, but it is empty. It will need to be recharged. Of course it will be. <laughs> of course it will be. He seems to still get winded after a couple of steps, though. From what I could tell. Actually, I don't know. I don't know. He might just very well have unlimited sprint. I highly doubt it, though. I need this battery charged. No problem. Here you go. Thanks. All right. Remember to restock the ammo box. Here, here's the thing I was wanting to look at. Oh, yes. I guess I'll take about that. Time Thank I you very much. Auto. See you later, bitch. I think I'll do this next part, or this next thing, and then I'll call it a... 
I'll wrap this part up for you all. I'm probably going to get it a little around 20 minutes, maybe more or less, give or take a couple of minutes. <laughs> but I appreciate some uh, positive support. Oh, wait, here we go. I know how to dodge. Don't need to tell me that. I'm just not going to let him get near me. SMG is new, from what I can tell. Oh, shit! Woo! Come on, bitch, bring it. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I love that. That's never gonna get old. Where's this friend? There, there we go. Yeah, yeah, it's... Oh, shit! Yeah, there we go. There's another one? I'm not really digging these holes like this top ordeal, you know? I need to just go the hell on somewhere. Alright, let's get some more ammo here. Ooh, that's actually kind of nice how it uh, just has everything there for me. If I swap weapons, it, it you know. Oh, clear oil fields of enemies. Alright, so I gotta head back the way I came, apparently. <laughs> and that's... Oh, here we go. Holy shit. Is it time for the flare gun, guys? I don't know. Oh, shit. Oh, I know these guys. You know, do that crazy shit on me. So there's, there's three of them total at the start. Yeah, it's about time for that flare gun. Yeah. Nothing. The fuck? Oh, come on, give me a break. <laughs> oh, I think that should do it. That should very well do that. Hang on, let me get some more of this. Ammo before I run out. Time to make some serious changes. All right. The wheel was in place. The oil was flowing. The battery was attached. The lights were blinking. The CD was playing in the boombox. I mean, that's cool. I just. Why, why does the CD have to be playing again? <laughs> That's kind of ridiculous. I don't really think it matters which order. It was in place. All right, the wheel was in place. Let's do ahead this. Oh come on! What the hell? There we go. Those basic puzzles. 